How you doing? This is Roger from uh, Back to the Basics. Today I wanted to talk about something I came up with. Um, I've seen a lot of uh, different uh, handle ideas for uh, for the water bottle here, guy bottle, or um, I've seen one that is basically a coat hanger that makes a spring, and that works great. My only problem with that is is that it um, I have to pack that somewhere in my bag, and as you guys saw in my kit, I don't have a lot of room. Um, the other one was uh, actually going ahead and attaching uh, little clamps to the or, uh, drilling holes and attaching little rings for a hook to ha you know handle to hook up to. Um, my problem with that is, is either you're leaving them on there and it's attached to your bottle all the time, and when you're doing anything, it, uh, the handle's going to get hot, and I don't like that idea either. Um, if it works good for you great. Um, I'm just simply showing another another method, something that I don't I don't think I've seen anywhere else, which is my goal in all my videos, is trying to come up with stuff that's different from everybody else. Um, what I came up with was uh, taking a, uh, just, well, I used a 16-penny nail, but you could use like a coat hanger or whatever, and all you're doing is making like a little omega-looking sign. The idea is to cut it just so that it fits right inside, right inside the bottle here like this once it goes inside and all we have to do is take a piece of cordage and uh, just tie a little loop here like so like that run it through makes kind of a little slip knot thing and uh, all I'm going to do is run it back through like so cinch that up good and tight and what this does is you can see this slides right inside and there we go so all I need is cordage and a wire to get it out it's as simple as just kind of sticking your finger in there a little bit it comes right out um, again just drop it in and uh, grab a hold you know, um, hopefully you can see all this. I'm not sure where the camera's at. I don't have the greatest camera. Anyway, it comes right out. So, if you don't want to use a coat hanger and make your own little little thing, what well you can do, same method. I'll take this off real quick. So all you really need is a, a piece of cordage out there. And I'm sure you guys know how to make cordage by now, or you'll have some with you, most likely you'll have something with you um, so as you can see I got the little slip knot thing going here you can see that all I'm going to do is take a stick kind of measure it a little bit break it off, I got a little stick stick through here pull it tight drop it in voila so there's my handle good enough for me, gets it out of the fire, um, it's, it's, uh, it's light, it's out of my way, and everything else. If we look at the one that, this is just one I did for, uh, just for the purpose of doing this video, but the one that I had, I have a little clip on it for the lid, clips right onto the lid, D-ring or whatever, same thing, I got the little slip knot type thing on there run my little metal piece right in the right in the center I'll give you a close-up view of that you can see that hopefully anyway and I drop it in there again that simple to get it out not much work what's cool is I can run this through the handle here all I have to do is take the center of the string run it through here and this is usually how I have it on my belt. As you can see, it kind of catches on the on the handle there. Different types of bottles probably won't have the same types of attachments. But what I like about this is that when it's all attached to the actual bottle, it's all attached to the actual bottle here. It's uh, I got my loop. If I can get that thing around. I got my loop so I can carry it. But when I want, if I want the hook. I just let it go 
and now I can take the lid off, put the bottle next to the fire, you can see that, put the bottle next to the fire or whatever, when it's hot, again, just drop it in, pick it up. And it works with a stick. Um, if you needed to use some sort of cordage, I'm sure you could use bark. You wouldn't need to necessarily make the cordage any sort of, you know, bark that you could peel off of any tree. It doesn't have to be strong. All you're doing is picking up a little bit of water. So, and then hook a string, hook a, a stick to it and drop it in the hole and pick it up. So anyway, I think it's an original idea. I'm, I'm not sure. I'd, I haven't seen it anywhere else on the internet. But like everything I come up with, somebody else has already done it. But anyway, I haven't seen this one. I like it. It's effective and works for me. So anyway, this has been Roger with uh, Back to the Basics. I appreciate your uh, subscriptions and views.